Hi there, this is Roderick from Toy Masters Video Magazine. We had the licensing show 2007. We had DreamWorks with Rick Reckendahl. And we all know DreamWorks from Shrek, Shrek 1, Shrek 2, and now Shrek 3 that just came out. What, um, May? Yeah, just last month. Last month. And also, uh, what else do we have? Oh, Madagascar. That's right. Yeah, yeah. Chris Rock. <laughs> as a zebra. Um, hey Rick, so how are you doing? I'm doing good, thank you, Rod. Okay, so what's happening with DreamWorks? Well, we're here at the licensing show this year. Um, we have had just come off a great success with Shrek the Third, that's uh, going over $300 million at the box office in the U.S. just today, so that's the day you're here. Uh, we came off a really great event last night to kick off the licensing show here in New York City in Manhattan. We had over 450 licensees getting together last night to see a sneak preview of Kung Fu Panda which is coming a year from now, in June of 2008. Oh. Last night on stage we had uh, Jeffrey Katzenberg, who is the CEO of DreamWorks, and Jack Black, our guest star, who's the voice of Poe the Panda. And so we announced last night, here at the licensing show, that Mattel is going to be the master toy licensee for Kung Fu Panda. Oh. And we also uh, reminded everybody that Activision, who's our long-term video game partner, is going to be doing the video games for Kung Fu Panda as well. In fact, we showed uh, about a minute, one minute clip of the video game uh, that's in progress right now. You know, we started Kung Fu Panda about two years ago in production. We started the video game a year and a half ago, so we have been working on that video game for already 18 months with another 10 months to go. That game is going to have a 28-month development cycle, the, the most important, the biggest game we've ever done. And this is for Kung Fu Panda. Yeah, for Kung Fu Panda. Um, what systems is that? Well, we'll be on with? all the consoles. We'll be on Xbox 360, PlayStation 3, Wii, dual screen, Game Boy Advance, all of them. PSP. On PSP, uh, PC versions as well. PC version. Will that be playing for both PC and Mac? Uh, we usually try to do the Mac version as well. The Mac sometimes takes another month to come out, you know, because they have to convert at the end. Mm -hmm. But we try to cover everybody if we can. Okay. And you said Mattel is the master toy license for Kung Fu Panda. Yes, for Kung Fu Panda. Yeah. So they'll be doing action figures, play sets, uh, inter interactive plush, uh, talking toys, uh, board games, puzzles, skill and action games, you name it. Okay, now let's, um, Madagascar 2 is coming out also. Yeah, Madagascar 2, uh, The Crate Escape, is coming out in the end of 2008. And so we're here at the licensing show in large part to talk to folks about getting on board the Madagascar program. So Activision is going to do the games for those as well. And we've actually started uh, development on the Madagascar 2 game about four months ago, five months ago, also with Activision, like I said. And then uh, we're, we're looking for new licensing partners here for the Toy Partner and some of the other companies that have come on board. You really didn't do that for the first one, did you? Uh, Hasbro did the toys for Madagascar 1, so we had a really good program with them um, two, three years ago when that program came out. Okay. I really don't remember that. Oh, come on, Rod, those are great toys. Yeah. <laughs> you know, one thing about Madagascar that's kind of interesting is a lot of people don't realize how successful it was for us. That very quietly, Madagascar was the biggest first launch movie that ever came from DreamWorks, bigger than Shrek 1. We did over $520 million at the box office worldwide on Madagascar 1. We sold over 5 million video games of the first Madagascar game, and we won the Kids' Choice Award at the Nickelodeon Awards for uh, Favorite Video Game of the Year. So we really had a great start with Madagascar, but we're looking forward to bringing it, you know, full circle next year with Mad 2. Okay, so that's Madagascar, Kung Fu Panda. Yeah. Uh, any other um, anime? Um... You know, this may sound like old news to you, but in fact, the other big news we have for the licensing show this year is a program we're calling Shrek Ever After. And so, like you said, we've done Shrek 1, we've done Shrek 2, we've done Shrek the 3rd. Now we're going to launch Shrek Ever After. And so in 2008, you're going to see a program roll out from us that has parts of the Shrek universe for pretty much everybody. So for boys, we have Ugly Ever After. For uh, people who like the Shrek babies and the little donkeys, the dragon donkey babies, we have Cuddly Ever After. Uh, for people who like our version of the Shrek princesses, we have Pretty Ever After. And, so, and we even have a holiday special coming up. We're going to do a Shrek Merry Ever After uh, program. So the Shrek Ever After program in 08 is our the big news. All right. Anything else in 2009 that we should know about? Well, we have a lot of properties coming in 2009 and 10, and that's what we want you to come back next year to see. Uh, okay. I can tease you a little bit with that, Rob. All right. Well, thanks a lot, Rick. Of course. Rick Lindell from DreamWorks. Thank you. Thank you.